Hi guys, so today we're going to be reviewing uh, the brand new Hocker Challenger ATR7s. Um, just came out just before Christmas, mid-November time. Um, and it's, uh, it's a shoe that I really loved, uh, maybe four and five version. It's a really good shoe for those people that want to run a little bit of off-road, a little bit of on-road. Maybe you run around the streets in the week and then at weekends you might go over the over off-road or over the park or something like that um, because um, it's uh, an all-terrain shoe and that's what it's uh, what the ATR is for so you've got uh, quite a tough upper um, but still stretchy still quite soft and and uh, flexible and then you've got uh, a real big sort of soft cushioning a bit similar to the Hocker Clifton's if you know that shoe soft all the way through uh, and then uh, you know a minimal grip on the back bottom nothing major simple grip format you know block um, blocks on the bottom to give you that that drive uh, and a little bit of angled uh, grip on the sides to give you a bit of uh, safety into the corners um, and it's just a dead simple shoe it's a little bit more wider fit than uh, the standard hocker range although having done a lot of miles in the previous versions I would say the 7 feels a little bit smaller than than normal to me uh, I would say that it, it in, in both length and width it feels a little bit tighter than um, than I remember from like the model 5 so far I've done four park runs in this couple of long runs a uh, couple of runs on the road um, and I you know, it's I really like it. It's just dead simple. It, it's soft. It's cushioning, cushioned. Uh, it's comfortable. I've got quite flat, wide feet, um, um, so it's got plenty of room inside. Although I do use an orthotic, um, which is in there, I, it does make it a little bit tight. But hey, uh, putting orthotics into shoes does make uh, does take up a lot of room. Um, I wouldn't say there's anything particularly bad about the shoe. Uh, maybe if you uh, if you're looking for really quick times it's perhaps not the shoe for you but it is really comfortable uh, it is really forgiving uh, it is a great shoe if you want like I say before if you want to do a bit of everything uh, that grip although it's not um, it's not super grippy you wouldn't say it's a massive kind of trail shoe uh, it is it is good enough for what most people want which is running on pretty hard stone tracks a little bit of muddy track maybe a bit across the grass it's pro plenty capable um, weight wise comes in around about 260 grams pretty light as well um, yeah I, I, there's nothing really I can particularly say bad about the shoe uh, I do really like it if I was putting my money somewhere and I was to buy this shoe I'd be happy with that it would it's a good good shoe great all-rounder um, and um, Anybody that's maybe looking for a hocker shoe that wants a slightly wider fit, um, certainly give it a go um, and uh, try it on. See how you get on.